do we connect Lapu-Lapu, 21 Jump Street, Pirates of the Caribbean, Starship Troopers, and President Ramon Magsaysay? In Philippine history, Lapu-Lapu was the fearsome chieftain from Cebu who repelled the first Spanish invasion and killed explorer Fernando Magallanes or Magellan, leader of that expedition. By the time Magellan and his crew reached the Philippines, they had been at sea for more than a year. Magellan underestimated the size of the ocean and the ships were unprepared for the journey. Many crew members starved while searching for land. What happened after all that traveling? Well, upon landing in Cebu, Magellan was able to convert some of the natives to Christianity. One of them was the Cebuano King Humabon who sought to fight against a neighboring group, the Mactan, who did not convert. Cebuanos asked Magellan to join them in their fight and he agreed. Against the advice of his own men, Magellan led the attack thinking that European weapons and armor would ensure a quick victory. Well, he was wrong. On April 27, 1521, the Portuguese explorer was killed by a poison arrow during a skirmish on the island of Mactan. Talk about bad luck. Fast forwarding to a more recent year, in 2002, former Pampanga Governor Mark Lapid produced a film about Lapu-Lapu starring, well, his father, Senator Lito Lapid. The film featured Dante Rivero as Magellan and included former sexy star Joyce Jimenez as tribal maiden Bulacna. Two years earlier, Jimenez starred in a film adaptation of the Harold Robbins novel, Body Parts, also screened as vital parts in some territories, I don't know why. Oh, oh yeah, you're beautiful. Well, there are a lot of rich men over there, and I like rich men. You know, they give you things like, you know, these earrings. Aren't they pretty? Very pretty. Joyce's leading man in that film was Richard Grieco, one of the original stars of the 21 Jump Street TV series alongside Johnny Depp. And it also had such memorable lines of dialogue, such as, you're so big. I'm just kidding, it wasn't memorable. Depp, of course, became one of the world's biggest film stars, consistently scoring box office hits with the Pirates of the Caribbean series, which was based on the animatronic Disneyland attraction. In 1999, Depp appeared in the suspense movie about the Headless Horseman entitled Sleepy Hollow. Also cast in the film was a former Hollywood hunk by the name of Casper Van Dien, who became typecast for his role as Johnny Rico in the Starship Troopers, where he played a Space Marine. Ironically, in the original novel by Robert Heinlein, Johnny Rico was Juan Rico, the son of rich Filipino parents. Heinlein had a habit of hiding his character's ethnicity until the last minute. At the end of the Starship Troopers novel, Rico even praised Philippine President Ramon Magsaysay. And that's Flip Lang, where we connect the dots from everyone and everywhere and bring it back home to the Philippines. I'm Bill Velasco, and you're not.